So why don't we just regulate guns the way that, you know, we can regulate guns, right? The, the Supreme Court has not forbidden us from regulating guns, uh, although they may. I mean, there's a, there is a Supreme Court decision on guns that will be coming down in the next month that may blow up New York State's law, New York State's gun control laws. But for the moment, why don't we regulate guns like we regulate abortion? When you go in to buy a gun, you've got to watch a movie showing, you know, the death and destruction, the carnage. Why don't we allow, you know, there, when uh, Stoneman Douglas, when that massacre happened, there were parents who were saying, and kids, who, you know, the, the hashtag, show my picture. There were parents who were saying, the, 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 these gruesome, bloody pictures of my child, you may publicize them. No media in America would do it. It was the leaking of the photos of the victims in Australia that led to that nationwide revulsion that led to their change, their change in their gun laws. So why don't we do this like abortion, right? There's only one gun store in the state. You gotta travel to that gun store. You gotta wait three days from the time you, you show up and you apply to buy the gun and you come back three days later. You get a wand stuck up your butt just for the hell of it. You have to watch a, a movie. You have, to, you have to show that you have been counseled by your pastor and your spouse, or that you have the permission of your spouse. Or is, it, is Ruth Ben-Ghiat right that really what's going on here is that the Republicans actually want there to be mass school shootings because that will lead to an, a more authoritarian America. More people will say, yes, we, we need, we need a, a strong man in charge. She said, she writes in her newsletter today, as an expert on authoritarianism, I see Republican complicity in transforming public schools into death traps as part of a deliberate strategy to create an atmosphere of fear and suspicion conducive to survivalist mentalities and support for illiberal politics. Republicans know that the chaos and trauma created by school shootings is an efficient way of destabilizing communities and societies. Seeing gun violence through the lens of authoritarianism helps us to understand the big picture. Is this why Republicans are celebrating the NRA this weekend? Because they like slaughter in our society? Because it will lead to more heavily armed police and more prisons and more, and you know, more tough, tough laws? Seriously?